dusty, <laughs> but safe. And the crowd goes wild. Yay! All right! Go, Dennis! That's the game. Anyone interested in going to lunch? <laughs> Winning the big game sure is tiring. Hey, Slugger, you think you got enough energy to put away the equipment? Sure thing. Us big leaguers <sighs> never run out of energy. I could be a pro ball player if I wanted. Mr. Wilson says I <sighs> throw baseballs through his window like a pro. I'll show Dennis. I'm going to hit this pitch right through Dennis's window for a change. seen a catch like that in my entire life. You kidding? I made six of them in practice this morning. That was a sure home run. How'd you ever learn to catch like that? Learn? How some things just come naturally. Dennis, I bet my lunch money on this game. If we can only score this inning, we'll be the world champions. Dennis, can I have your autograph? Of course. Anything for my fans. Here you go. Thanks, Mr. Dennis. Here you go, young lady. Ooh. Ooh. Wish me luck. I hate hitting singles. Slugger, you missed lunchtime. Where are all my fans? Fans? <laughs> what do you think? You just won the World Series? Must be nice to dream. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Damn it. George, I think I need a new wardrobe. My dresses don't fit anymore. <coughs> new wardrobe? That's expensive. Couldn't you just go on a diet? 
Oh, all right, dear. I'll go on a diet, but only if you'll go on a diet, too. Hey, why do I need a diet? My clothes fit just fine. That's why, dear. That, and because otherwise, I'm going down to the shopping mall with the credit card. <gasps> credit card? All right, you win. When do we begin? Now. Oh. Chocolate chip cookies. Maybe I could take just one. George? Those are for Dennis, dear. Dennis? Hi, Mr. Wilson. Thanks for the cookies, Mrs. Wilson. Potatoes, pasta, and pie. Mmm, now that's my kind of day. George, dinner will be ready as soon as the guests arrive. Yes. Hi, Mr. Wilson. <sighs> oh. The Mitchells are joining us for dinner tonight, dear. Isn't that nice? One for Henry, one for Alice, and one for Dennis. And for a special treat... Oh, boy, oh, boy. One for Ralph. Ralph? Where's my dinner? Don't worry, Mr. Wilson. Here comes your dinner now. It's about time. I'm so hungry I could eat a rutabaga. Don't worry, Mr. Wilson. You don't like it. Ruffle eat anything. Jeez. Food. 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 Mr. Wilson, what you doing? <laughs> uh, nothing. Just doing some uh, diet exercises. Oh, okay. I saw light downstairs, and I thought you were a burglar. Oh, well, thanks, Dennis. Anytime you see a burglar, you just call the police. Good night, now. Hold it right there! Hey, turn that light out! Oh. Good thing you called us, young man. Looks like it was a burglar, all right. Mr. Wilson told me to call in case I saw one. Now that's what I call a good neighbor. Oh, just trying to help. Oh, if I don't get out of here and get something to eat, I'm going to die of starvation. Breakfast! Oh, boy. Food at last. I hardly know where to begin. Hi, Mr. Wilson! Huh? There you are, George. Come along, dear. It was all a mistake. Yeah, I thought you were a burglar. That's pretty funny, huh, Mr. Wilson? Now come along, dear. But, but. George! 
At last, the coast is clear. Now to slip down to this door and pick up some food. Hi, Mr. Wilson. Where are you going? Well, I'm uh, just going shopping, Dennis. Oh, boy. I like shopping. Let's go. Mr. Wilson, I thought you and Mrs. Wilson were on a diet. Uh, we are. Who's all this stuff for? Well, since you asked, it's for um, your next birthday. Gee, thanks. Then can we get rid of all this healthy stuff and get some good stuff? Oh, whatever you say. Take it easy, Dennis. But the whole gang will be there. So we need a couple more candy bars and some watermelons. <laughs> no way! Hey! What about my birthday? I'm gonna get off this diet. It's making me crazy. Huh? I never... Hello there, George. Have you met my boss, Simon Gordo? He's the big cheese down at our plant. <laughs> He gets a little strange sometimes. I gotta get some food. Any food. Supper's ready. Food. Food. That did it! <laughs> you who, George? He doesn't look too good, Mrs. Wilson. Maybe he should try a different diet. I quit, Martha. Go ahead and spend all our money on clothes. I don't care. I've had it. But, George! Give me your biggest deluxe pizza with everything on it, and hurry! Yes, sir. One jumbo deluxe coming up. Oh, food at last. I can hardly wait. There he is! Ooh. Oh, no! That kid is trying to starve me to death. And there he goes. George, wait! Oh, he didn't give me a chance to tell him I've agreed to cancel his diet. Good idea, Mrs. Wilson. He doesn't need it with all that jogging he's doing. One jumbo deluxe with everything. Oh, well, no point in letting it go to waste, right? That's for sure. Mm-hmm. I can't tell you how good those cookies smell, Martha. I know, dear. And this batch will be all for you. Ah, at last. My own cookies. Not for that pest, Dennis. Just for me. Me, me, me! Hello? Oh, yes. Hello, Dr. Winchell. Mr. Wilson's blood test? Oh, dear. High blood pressure? Huh? No more starches or carbohydrates? Huh? All right, doctor. I'll tell him. What did he say? He says you have to go on a diet. Oh, no! I know, dear. But at least these cookies won't go to waste. They won't? Oh, no. Hi, Mr. Wilson. What's cooking?
Dennis, what are you and these kids doing? We're practicing for the talent show. Talent show? Our band is gonna win the trophy. For first place. And maybe we'll make an album. How do we sound, Mr. Wilson? Sound? Dennis, there are no words to describe your sound. Gee, thanks, Mr. Wilson. We'll play another... No, no, take a break. We will, Mr. Wilson, in another hour or two. No! This should be fine. Dennis! Did you ever hear such an awful sound? Nah, uh, they don't sound too bad to be, Dad. They're horrible. They certainly wouldn't deserve to be in the same talent show with you. What did you say? I simply said that band won't stand a chance against my Timmy. Well, it so happens they are in the talent show. Well, it would be better if they didn't show up at all. Their band is unique, and with a little practice, they could win first place. Oh, yeah? Yeah! Well, we'll see you there. You bet. We'll be the group with the first prize trophy. Let's go, Timmy. Gee, Mr. Wilson, you were great. Yeah! yeah. Never mind that. There's work to do. Everyone in my backyard in five minutes. Okay, once again. Oh, We're tired, Mr. Mr. Wilson. Can we rest now? We must practice until we get it. I think it got us first, Mr. Wilson. We've been practicing all day. Can't we rest? Not yet. Remember, in two days, we'll be in that auditorium. Now, who's going to win first place? We are. And who has the best band? We do. Yay! Yeah. 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 And that was the juggling twins. Next, we have Timmy the tennis singing. Uh, well, he's going to sing something. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. You are lost and gone forever. Dreadful sorry, Clementine. <laughs> bravo, bravo. And finally, we have uh, the Backyard Band playing something. And now, after 15 talented acts, the first place trophy goes to... my nephews, the Juggling Twins! We're sorry, Mr. Wilson. We let you down. Nonsense. I'm proud of each one of you. And the second place trophy goes to... The Backyard Band! Wow! Alice! Mr. Wilson, the band wants you to keep our trophy. Me? But... We couldn't have done it without you. That's right. It's true. Here, Mr. Wilson. Really, Dennis? Really.
Teacher!